Hey guys, I'm Patriot Warrior, the Irish Gamer, and welcome back to So, uh, if you watched the last episode, which I uh, totally recommend, uh, it should be up in the top right right about now, uh, we are going to continue working on our bug house. So, I have gotten a plan on what I want to do, and I've done some work on it. Uh, you can kind of see my uh, inventory there real quick, uh, what I'm kind of using, and... Well, before we get started with this episode anyways, uh, I would just like to say that uh, about half of the people that watch my videos uh, are not subscribed, so uh, I would like to ask uh, you guys to uh, hit that subscribe button. Uh, it's completely free. You can always unsubscribe if you don't like it. And, uh, well, let's get into the episode real quick. Don't want to hold you back any longer. So, I have done some work on our book house. You can kind of see it from here. I've gotten the idea of what I want to do so that I wasn't just standing there looking like a doofus like I did last episode. Uh, so now uh, we can actually do some work on screen. Uh, I'll probably do some more work off screen, but uh, as you can see, I've gotten the front entrance right here done. I'm going to add probably some more stuff here, like some water or something like that. Do some cool stuff with that. I've gotten the walls a little bit up. I've gotten the pathway in. I don't know what I'm going to make the inside of this yet. I don't know what I'm going to put for that. Uh, I've gotten one enclosure basically done. I just need to go farther back to that wall and get to the back. And then I can decorate the inside of it. And that one will be done. I've got an entrance over here. But as you can see, my plan is, is for the corners and stuff like that, I'm using this spruce wood as I used for the entrance too. I think it looks really nice. And uh, I'm using brick, stone brick, as the border for the ground and stuff like that. But I'm making sure that the windows are all the way from ground level to the top. At first I had it go like this, but I decided to change it. And the nice thing with this glass, other than it being completely, you know, clear, except for the edges so that you know where it is. Uh... <laughs> Wait, what am I think? Oh yeah, <laughs> sorry, completely forgot. <laughs> Uh, you can break it with a pick, and it doesn't break like glass. You can just pick it back up since it's reinforced glass, which I think is awesome. So I don't feel bad for trying to like break it to see what I like. So basically, we're gonna take all this stuff and start putting it onto these other ones. Uh, I've also done it on this part too a little bit. It's pretty simple design. I don't know what I'm gonna do over here yet. So I'm gonna go back over here to this side, and we can start in on this part. So let's get rid of this wool real quick. There we go. So uh, everything's kind of going crazy in the world now, huh? Yeah, everything's going crazy. 2020 is just a dumb year. It's it's a bad year. Oh man, I don't know what everybody has on their minds. It's just ridiculous. I mean, there's riots going on and all that stuff. Uh, I mean, like, not that long ago, like, not even, like, two weeks ago, everybody was like, we need to stay inside at all times. And now everybody's running around outside uh, protesting and stuff like that and big crowds and stuff like that. And it's like, weren't you the guys that were saying we need to all, like, stay inside before? Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's crazy. Uh, I don't want it like this, though. I don't know why I did this. Well, I kind of do, but I don't. So I'm going to fix this. Thank you. Let's cut that down. It'd be easy. So then, right here, we take this part. And we simply replace, like this. And then we can fill it in with our gray, light gray concrete. I do like this block. It actually isn't too bad, though, this, like, I wish this was a little bit, it uh, complemented the stone brick a little bit better. Because the, it's very, uh, one color, I guess you could say. There's, like, no variety. It's all the same shade that's, like, barely lighter, barely darker. It's almost, like, a blank, it's almost the exact same color throughout. While this is, like, very different and stuff like that. Same with this. Gosh, man, I always burp during episodes. That's my thing, apparently. That's my thing, other than being the redheaded, <laughs> the redheaded uh, YouTuber, is that I burp everywhere. Also, uh, for those of you that uh, 
<laughs> just wonder why I said redhead. Uh, I'm definitely a redhead, just so you know. Uh, people probably... I figure people will probably already be like, uh, duh, because of my, uh, <laughs> just because of my avatar. My avatar is kind of a remake of me, myself, even though you haven't seen my face. So basically, you've had a face reveal by something I made to look like me, in a way. Although, my avatar looks a lot better than I do in real person. And... The funny thing is, I actually uh, recently grew out a beard because of uh, the quarantine and all that stuff. During quarantine, and I actually made the beard for my character for my avatar like a long time ago. So my avatars had a beard longer than me. Heck, I didn't even know I could grow a beard as long as I have until recently. So <laughs> I I read the future of my avatar. Love the creation of my avatar, so that's I find that funny. So now I actually really look like my avatar. Um, so yeah. Uh, so if you didn't know, the uh, the creatures we're gonna be putting in here are gonna be the like uh, what are they called? Cambrian, I guess they would be. I think they'd be the Cambrian. It's the era before the dinosaurs, so before the Mesozoic. It's that era, which had, you know, the introduction of most of the, of most life before the dinosaurs and all that stuff came along. I can't remember it off the top of my head. I know the Mesozoic era pretty well, because uh, you got the Triassic, Triassic, Jurassic, Cretaceous. Uh, then I know there's like Cambrian and then Precambrian. I know there's Cambrian, but that's about as much as I know before, because it's been a while. I used to be a nut with this stuff, but uh, I've recently uh, backed off all this stuff. I'm not as crazy about it as I used to be, but it's, you know, it happens. I still like it. I just have other interests now. Uh, a good place I feel like you could search it up is uh, PBS Eons. I've watched those guys a couple times about stuff. There's some cool stuff that they put up. They do a bunch of stuff about, like, um, the past, not just dinosaurs, they do uh, uh, pa post dinosaurs, they've done stuff uh, pre dinosaurs, well, pre Mesozoic, and all that stuff. I mean, they've done stuff about human evolution, uh, about horses, all that stuff. It's pretty cool. Uh, they were actually really cool to watch. All right, man, we got a whole ton of work done real fast, and I was actually talking through most of it. That's awesome. So what should we do? You know, real quick, let's just start digging this out. I have I have the ultimate shovel. <laughs> also, you were like, why is there sand and clay underneath all this dirt? Uh, I actually used to have like a little pond here. Uh, I didn't build it here; it was just randomly generated. Uh, so I filled it in so that I had more space. Cause I'm kind of yeah. Here it is. <laughs> Here's part of it. I guess it wasn't all one D. Some of it was a little bit deeper. But yeah, this this shovel is ridiculous. I love it. It's the best shovel I've ever made. Well, the best shovel I've ever enchanted in Minecraft. I'm happy about it. Oh, man, I'm stupid. Look at this. Look at the big dingus I am. I didn't even put down the stuff. Uh, so let's get this stone brick out, huh? I'll come back to you. Do -do -do. I'm not worried about this one. This one's going to be covered under something, so you won't see it. While these you will see, and I wanted them to be, you know, look like it was reinforced and meant to hold something back so it couldn't get in. You know? That was kind of the idea. Because the glad. Uh, so, the inspiration. I have two inspirations for uh, this design. And, uh,. One of them, some of you guys may know him, uh, he is the Chaotic Craft. Uh, a little while ago, he did a, a bug house episode, well, episodes of him building his own bug house for his own uh, dinosaur thing. So I recommend if you want even more dinosaurs than just me, uh, I recommend go checking him out. He's pretty cool, dude. Uh, he's done he's done several parks in the past, so he knows what he's doing a little bit better than me, at least, of all this stuff. So. Uh, if you want to check out more of that type of stuff, uh, go check him out. Uh, 
I probably won't put a thing up in the top right, but he does have an easy name to find. And his main thing is dinosaurs, so... I guess I basically like him, but I do try to do other stuff. Uh, recently, so somebody explained this to me uh, in the comments below if you could. So I recently put up an episode of Terraria. Uh, I made a Terraria episode because people wanted me to, they said, so I did. And I felt really inspired to do a uh, tutorial. I wanted to try and do it for once. I've never done it before. Uh, I wanted to experiment and see how people liked it, and well, uh, five people have watched it so far, which which is normal, about five people for stuff that isn't Minecraft dinosaurs. That's about normal for that type of stuff, but the thing that really uh, confused me was the fact that I got two, the first two people that watched the video liked it, like they liked the video, so yeah, but the average watch time of the video out of the five people that have watched it is only 26 seconds like how, how does that work that's what i want to know how does that make any sense how can you like a video that you watch 26 seconds of that, that's what i want to know I, I i what i think it is is that uh i kept getting spam accounts commenting on my videos saying dumb stuff I've seen them before. I think I've posted on Twitter about them before because I've seen other people complain about them. And uh, I've had them too. And what I th I think they almost always uh, do that. They always like a video for some reason, even though they're a spam account. Because they'll like and comment the video. But the thing is, uh, the video has no comments on it. The one I was, <laughs> The one I made has no comments on it. But that, but the reason why there's no comments on it if they liked it, if it was them that had uh, liked the video and watched it, uh, I hid and blocked their the spam accounts channels uh, from commenting on my videos anymore. So all they could do is watch the video and like it, but they wouldn't be able to comment. I think that's what probably happened. But still, it's like, oh, okay. So yeah, I don't know if I'm going to do another one of those. I might uh, in the future, but not immediately. Uh, this weekend... Uh, I'm going to be probably doing a Minecraft uh, Dungeons uh, episode because I put up a thing. I put up a poll like I did for uh, Terraria, and a bunch of people said they wanted me to do it last week. And since I already had a video uh, planned, I wasn't going to do it that weekend. So I'm going to do it this weekend. I just need to record it. I think I'm going to do that tomorrow probably. Yeah, tomorrow sounds good. I don't want to record uh, two videos today. I uh, don't really have to time for it and plus I don't feel like it you know I mean I like recording it's fun but I kinda need to think about what I wanna do first ah, yeah. good thing I was cooking up some uh, stone so I'm gonna go grab some of that and see what else I have um, in my uh, storage that I could use for a floor uh, should I use calamite wood I use that for my roads so I don't know if I should use it for yeah, I don't think I want to use it for my, uh, what's it called, uh, for my floor. I might use Cordite. Cordite might be cool. Uh, let's try Cordite planks. Because they're like brighter, uh, versions of, it's like a mi I guess Cordite, a good example of what Cordite wood looks like is it's a mix of jungle and spruce wood is what it kind of looks like in color. Uh, yes, I have more. Perfect. So, keep those. Uh, you come here. Oh, yeah, that's full. Yeah, that's that's how much landscaping I do. Uh, I don't always fill in stuff, but I certainly do dig up. I get rid of a lot of dirt. So, let's get rid of all of these. All of these. Ooh, oxy daisies. I'm going to need those for more concrete. So, perfect. The one, the one flower I actually wanted to keep. Uh, so, let's throw these in here. Thank you. Uh, let's just turn this in the gray dye already. Get out of the way. Um, what else? I don't need that. I can get away, get rid of this white wool. Don't need that. Uh, yeah, I think that's it. I just need to grab this stone over here that is cooking in my awesome super smelter. If you guys want, uh, I could do a tutorial on how to make, uh, eh, 
I don't really need to do a tutorial on this. I think I'm going to show you guys how to do it in the next episode of Minecraft Dinosaurs. As you can see, it's it's not hard. It's pretty simple. I don't know how to make the super big ones that take redstone and stuff like that. Because uh, I'm not that big of a redstone nut. I have try I try to do redstone sometimes. I get inspired to do it. But uh, I'm not very good at it. <laughs> I, I won't lie. I'm not very good at redstone. Uh, I get confused by it. I mean, to be honest, redstone is confusing. If you, like, haven't really put time into understanding it super well, it can be very, very confusing to do. I mean, I've tried to do redstone forever, and I used to have problems with just... I mean, I used to have problems just trying to sneak in, make uh, piston doors. I mean, have you guys heard of what jeb doors are? Uh, so a jeb door is a secret uh, piston door that you can make, which is one of the simpler designs. Uh, it's in a couple of Minecraft books uh, that they made, like tutorial books and stuff like that. It's in those. Uh, that's how I actually found out about it. But it's a flush uh, hidden piston door. Uh, so it you can't see it at all. You have no idea it's there, basically. As long as they use, like, you know, good stuff that keeps it hidden. Hey, I didn't want to do that. Uh, wrong one. So, but yeah, I had one of those, uh, you might have heard about them, but the, the guidebooks, like, to Redstone, I had a, I had those. I had the Redstone guide and all, like, the combat guide, the building guide. I had a bunch of those things because I was really into Minecraft a, long, a while back when I was younger. I, I'm still I am in the Minecraft a lot. I don't play it as much as I used to, but I'm still into it. Uh, I have to get more cordite planks, but that's about it for uh, here. I'm gonna go to sleep real quick, and then I guess we can end this episode. Uh, well, uh, back to what I was talking about. Uh, so I kept trying to build Jeb doors, and I could never build one. I always try. I always followed the dang thing to a T, and I just never could get it to work right. I think I recently got one to work. Uh, now that I'm older, I think I did it in my own, like, personal world or something like that. Or, uh, I don't remember. I think I did it, though. I think I went and tried to make one and it worked. I was so happy. I was like, yes, I finally did it. I finally accomplished something super simple and easy. But I did it. <laughs> yeah, I think I like this cordite. Yeah, the cordite looks pretty good. I think I'm going to add, like, some uh, rings like this that go around it so it's like you know you're in it. Like the sitting area to look at it. I think I'm going to do that. But uh, yeah, I think that's about it for this episode. So uh, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode.